This is cool. You got a nice room. I really like it. Um, okay, what if instead of like... I don't know. I don't know what to do, alright? Please! I think that worked out in the end. Hell. A pump flow regulator. A tower patrol founded by Memorial Lane in the Garden District. The problem is there's a potential showdown brewing over there between the patrol and a reclaimed camp. It could get bloody quickly ah uh, it is so good to be back uh, so today i get to be the errand boy for a snarky kid on the radio which you know fine by me totally okay with it i love to help people but see here's the thing the only reason I'm really doing anything about this is because apparently there's a war going on here. And, well, wars just so happen to be my cup of tea. Well, ain't this just the loveliest of abodes? Hmm, perhaps I'll bring a little... Housewarming gift, hello there, my fine female friend. I'll be coming back for you. I come bearing gifts in this time of war. No one gets inside, strict orders. If you have a problem with that, see Jeff, he's around the corner. Jeff, huh? You see, I don't really take orders or listen to orders from anyone and... <laughs> Perhaps you don't understand hey, that. Yeah, yeah, okay. You've got good resolve. I will give you that. Hey, asshole, look, don't touch. Oh, trust me, I am looking. And later, I will touch. Till then. Hmm. And you must be Jeff. <laughs> Hello, gentlemen. I am the tourist. What was he thinking? These are people who have chosen to be savages, not rational. You got nerve rolling in here uninvited. You got nerve talking to me like that. Yeah. Stare down, huh? Who's gonna blink first? Ah, oh, you lost, Jeff. I'm the bigger man. What's going on, buddy? I'm searching I'll for things. I'll clear out quick. Just need to recover something. Probably useless to you. Mind if I take a look around? Yeah, we mind. We have enough problems to deal with right now. Not gonna let some stray scrounge on our turf. A stray? Did you just call me a stray? Oh I prefer boy. I think of myself as a free agent. Open to all opportunities. You know what? Yeah, you might prove useful. Mm -hmm. My brother is in some deep shit. Pack of reclaimed scum snatched him. Anthony's a good kid. Bit dim, but he doesn't deserve whatever those freaks have in store. We can't get anywhere near where they're holed up. Light blue house across the way. They'll gut him immediately if they see us coming. But you? They don't know you. Hmm. You'll be able to stroll right in. After that, whatever you need to do, that's your business. Personally, I'd put a few bullets through their skulls. Let the dirt reclaim them. Oh. I do like the way you think, dear Jeffrey. And what's in it for me? What's in it for me? If he comes back alive, I'll let you snag a few things from our supplies. We've got some meds. Decent grub, hmm. ammo too. Just don't get greedy. Oh, sir. I am going to get greedy. Sounds like I can be of service. Get to it then. Oh. Knowing how those savages operate, you might not have much time before they execute them. I really, really do not like when you tell me what to do. Okay? I want to be clear. I'll help you get your brother. But you may not like the state that you find him in. Anthony... 
gentlemen. Be so dense. He should have known better. Mm. All right, Bernard. Looks like we've got a nice, exciting day ahead of us. Why, hello over there. Standing by that door? <laughs> Guess we'll get ready with a little bit of a zombie brain a bashing, huh? That's some good shit right there. Now, I am guessing they would like me to climb up here. But see, <laughs> I ain't one for sneaking around much. I'm one for more of an aggressive approach. Going through the front door kind of guy. Knock, knock. The tourist is home. Hmm. Well, hello there. Well, they just got you strung up right by the feet, don't they? I don't approve of that. The dead should be dead. Hello, Mr. Voodoo Doll. Mm, and I do like this cool hat. Hello, hello. The tourist is here. I'm gonna solve some problems. Oh. Hello, everybody. Don't mind me. Me and Bernard here, we're just, we're here to solve some problems. Figure out what's bothering both sides and, you know, maybe save the day, right? One, Who two, three, four. A big tough Jeff, too chicken shit to show his face and beg for his little brother's life. Not sure I really see the point. Hmm. You know, <laughs> Everyone is just talking down to me today, and I really, really fuck, don't. Oh, Grabby! So negotiator Grabby, you my name is Tourist. Like I was saying, I'm just passing through. I don't want any trouble. Looks like I just walked in on something that's none of my business. I smell bullshit. It's unwise to wonder where you don't belong, and you don't strike me as a fool. But hey. Uh. I'm willing to play along. We could use some entertainment around here. We are about to execute this filth. Wanna know why? Because he's wearing blue. <laughs> I mean, you and your people are more of a red type, and I get it. Red versus blue. There's a lot of hot feelings that go between those two colors, but what's your supposed reasoning, huh? Enlighten me. This subhuman shit is a murder. My daughter is dead. The tower is at fault, and he is at fault. The tower preaches community, and yet they toss out those most in need hmm. because they are no longer useful. Hmm. Because they are a burden. Violet was not a burden. She was a human being. Yeah, but, but this fucker. She was probably a little bit of a burden, right? I he mean, he disobeyed orders, but he did not. He forced her out, left her to die. She was 11 years old. Where is your head at, stranger? I mean, exterminate this tower, fuck right now, and we won't have a problem. Then we can pay the rest of the vermin a visit. Hmm. Once they are a pile of corpses, whatever is in their camp, it's yours. Consider it a gift from the reclaim. Now, you are speaking my language there at the end with the whole pile of corpses, but I do have to say, 11 year old girls, mm, probably actually a bit of a burden in these current times. Am I right? Okay, you didn't like that. I understand. I'm not saying yeah, your girl I in particular. Hmm. But you know what? I'll take him down. He deserves to die. And I will gladly do it. I tried to make things right. Did you, though? I tried. See, I'm not really oh, believing Warriors. that. That's all I'm guilty of, please. It wasn't my decision. If I didn't do it, someone else would have. There was no preventing her ex -hop. Look, uh... What I did Shut was up. Horrible. I admit it, but... Mm -hmm. Please. You don't have to do this. No, see, I do. Uh, because tactically speaking, I'm gonna take sorry. you out, and then these Please. morons are gonna rush into the tower base and die. I'm sorry. And it'll be very Please. easy for me to just clean up the mess. So, Anthony, nothing against you, horrible. you beautiful, admit, beautiful but... boy. Please. But Bernard, 
Well, you don't have to do this. What's you'd like a little bit of blood. You know, he's thirsty. Make things right. Real thirsty. I tried. And, well, you look like a really nice drink. I followed orders. Nothing against you, kid, but. That's all I'm guilty of, please. <laughs> it wasn't my decision. We did what we had to do, right? One less brain dead tower slug plaguing the world. Fuck it. I think it's time to put some pressure on these fuckers. We're outnumbered, but we have momentum, right? Yeah, the time is right fucking now. You with us? You know, uh, you, you guys go. Um, I will be no there shortly, like the okay? That's the attitude. We've got this. Let's send the message that the future belongs to the reclaimed. Eh, whatever. Just go die, okay? All right, Anthony, come along. We're gonna go show your brother what happened. Yeah. Oh, Anthony. Oh, no. A Anthony, you're phasing out of existence. My boy. Come. Come along. Look at him go. Those red shirts. Oh, they're taking a detour to kill some zombies? That doesn't seem very smart. Good luck in there. You know, I really hope you succeed. The tourist. Well, he is rooting for you. Go reclaimed. Oh, take him out. Ooh, gunshots galore. Go on in, kids. Go on in. Uh, Bernard, you had a nice little drink, but I think it's time for the heavy artillery. Uh, let's go say hello to Jeff, shall we? Hey, Jeff, uh, I couldn't bring your brother here. He did phase out of existence, but... Hello? Okay, all right. Here we go. Come say hello. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Jeff, you're very violent. Oh, Jeff, I just shot you in the head, my man. Oh. Jeff, Jeff, Jeff. I do hope you learned your lesson. You did call me a fucking stray. And I don't take too kindly to that, okay? I'm just gonna have your broken little gun here. All right, what is going on in here? Hmm. Interesting. Oh, look at this. Okay. Back up, back, no. Thank you, sir. Oh, you're a bad guy. All right, all right, all right, we're fine. I only got a little bit of shotgun bullets left. I guess it's time to just clean up whatever mess is left in here. Hello? Anybody left in here? Hmm. My beautiful watch girl. All gone. Very disappointing. Hello, hello, hello. Anybody upstairs? The tourist would like a word. Huh. Could that be everybody? Did my plan that I set into motion work perfectly? Mm. I do declare I am the MVP of today. Eat some dog food to get that stam back up. Take this medicine I can't really carry with me. Perfection. Oh, hello there. Seems like you survived, huh? Anything down there? Hi. Um, I think you're tower because you're wearing blue. Uh, I just want to say you have a beautiful face. If you. But it's more beautiful now. Oh. Oh, my dear. That is... That is rough. Anyone else in here? Hey, look at that. A secret keyhole. And a picture of a school, room 201. Well, this is the last room I haven't been in. And look at that. Hello. What must be... The pump regulator. Just gonna click that there. Perfection. Broken rifle. 
Whatever. Oh, I'm full now. Here's a letter. Pfft, probably nothing important. Maybe it's about Anthony <sighs> just talking about how he loved to just kill that girl, send her out, and have her die, and all that stuff. You know, fun. I heard a voice. Why, hello! You must be the lone survivor, huh? It looks like you have got blades for eyes now. That's like a superpower or something. You, sir, can be an X-Man. Wouldn't that be fun? <sighs> we have fun. We have fun. Well, we've got a little bit of time left before those bells toll. Let's just go explore a little bit in case we find anyone that seemed to have escaped our attention. Hello, sir. Would you happen to know if anyone living has been around here? Gonna take that as a no. Hello, ma'am. I am looking for some living folk. Sorry that you cannot help me. Well, I do think anyone that was alive at any point here in this beautiful part of New Orleans is no longer alive. Rats. This may end up being a terrible idea. Oh. It is rather brutal though. <laughs> Just you can really take the hits, my lady. What? Okay, all right. Not cool. Well, I almost missed you. And that would have just been a gosh darn shame. Hope you have a nice trip. See you next fall. I think I need more explosive puns. Mmm. It's okay. It's okay. There's nothing for you to worry about anymore. Well, that's not good. I do think we may need to busy ourselves out of here. I think. I got every last living soul. Oh, she is a zombie now. No arm. That's exciting. Hello, sir. You have a lot of friends about to join us. Gonna prefer they didn't quite catch up with me. Hi. Uh... You don't need to do what you're thinking about doing. We can be friends, right? Just get out of here. Okie dokie. Let's just skadoodle. That was a rough day. Mm. Mm. But nothing a little Nutria stew can't cure. Nutria stew. Buy it today at my shop thing. I hope you don't mind if you... Give me a hand here around the bus. I need someone to help clean up, get rid of some of these moths, and I think you'll do just fine. Well, pretty soon I might be able to make a whole person. Oh yeah, this is going to be one cool wall. Ah, my MVP trophy, just slide you right there. That is beautiful. Mm, got plenty of this. Oh, I am so strong now. And once again, wood scraps. My ultimate, ultimate enemy. All right, Casey. I got your piece of garbage thing. You there, Casey? 
Come in. Yeah, yeah, I I'm here. Wow, <laughs> you're back. Did you get it? Yeah, I got it. Along with a couple other things like death and an arm. You know, normal stuff. You're surprised? You didn't think I was gonna come through, did you? Well, guess what? I did. I didn't know. It's insane out there. That is true. All kinds of shit could have gone wrong. <laughs> but hey, this is great. Finally, some progress. Ugh. It's a relief. Okay, uh, let me find the manual for that thing, and we can get it calibrated. Yay! That's what I love to do. Why go out and stab people in the brain when I can calibrate water pumps? Thank you, KC. Uh, you owe me, buddy. Spill what you know about the reserve right now. Or I may have to misplace this contraption. Uh, okay, jeez, you're right. I owe you. No need for threats. Uh, I'll, I'll tell you what I know. The reserve is real. But you already knew that, right? I did. What you don't know is that I am in it. What? It's a military bunker built in the 50s or 60s. Right after the flood, the National Guard used it as a staging area to distribute disaster relief supplies. But once the dead started walking and things really went to shit, I had no choice but to get inside and hunker down. Mm -hmm. I thought I was safe for a little while, but now I'm fucked. Yeah, you Flood are. The water up top was too much for the reserve's pump system. It, it malfunctioned. And yada, yada, Casey. We get it. Down. There's a I'm lot of water. Room. I'm running out of time. I need to get out of here. Soon. God, I can't wait to see the sky again. You want me to get you a straw or something? You can drink your way out. I don't care what's going on. Why are you running out of time? What's the rush to get out of there? Starvation, for one. I might have a couple weeks left of scraps down here. Hmm. But none of that is going to matter if the flood water sitting on top of this place breaks through. Boosh. The room is filling up slowly right now, but it's only a matter of time before the ceiling collapses. Mm, that'd be fun. Crushed or drowned. Pick your poison, right? Hmm. If I had to choose, I'd say crushed because it's over quick, but for you, Casey, I'd rather you drown. Drowning sounds like a nightmare. Yeah, well, well with your help, I'm hoping to avoid all of it. Hmm. Fuck, I'd rather take my chances on the surface with a hundred walkers coming at me. At least I'd have a fighting chance. I oh, don't think you would. I'm not asking you to do this out of the kindness of your heart. There's no heart There's here, Casey. There's something in it for you, uh, uh, big time. If the pumps get repaired, not only will I get out, okay. the supply rooms will all open up. All those disaster relief supplies, untouched. Not hmm. to mention enough weaponry and gear to arm multiple platoons. All for you to do with as you please. And for me, a fresh start and some fresh fucking air. I do love me some guns, Casey. All right. But uh, why should I trust you? You haven't been up front with me so far. Why should I trust you? Because my life is in your hands. Oh, it is. I can't get out of this hole without your help. And look, hey, I get it. I could totally be full of shit. Mm -hmm. but one thing I know, no one else can offer you what I can. Without me, the reserve is going to remain buried forever. If you want the reserve, you're going to have to work with me. Oh, Casey. That's a chance you have to take. I'd really rather work alone, but I, I do like guns. Uh, I'm not sure, but uh, maybe. I'm not sure about this. It's a lot to take in. Nothing is certain in this fucked up world. I need your help or I'm dead. I choose the second one. Think it over. It, it, it's been a long night. We should both get some shut-eye. I'll contact you in the morning. Good night, tourist. Do you not want this pump regulator? That I yeeted away from us? Casey? Hey, Casey! Casey, come in! Casey! Well, that lantern's never gonna be lit again either, so... I guess... That is it. You know what? Maybe there's some music on my favorite station. We Ugh. cannot be afraid. Pass! You are so boring. Alright, well... Guess it's time for bed, and since uh, I've been alone for a while, I'm just gonna take this arm, picture of my new beautiful girl, and we're gonna have ourselves a night. Hello? It's Casey. Oh, good morning, Casey. Hello, beautiful MVP trophy, weird angel statues, my arm and my cool hat. It's just a good time to be alive. Hello. Hello, what's up? Are you there? Yeah, 
Glad to hear your voice. Ready to get started? I was ready last night, Casey, but that's fine. Let's go. Ready as I'll ever be. Okay, good. So I found the manual for Ugh. the pump flow regulator. It looks like we need to calibrate before it can be installed. Each of the pumps has different flow requirements. Uh tells the rest of the system where to route the water. All right, let's go. Give me the, the stuff. I'm smart. I can you do this. You should be able to figure this out. I like that attitude. Ugh. Okay. On the device, you should see a serial number. Read it to me. Serial number right here. 4730589-01. Okay. Uh, now turn the dial until you get some feedback on valve A. Uh, uh, then tell me the number you see. Fine. Start down. Nope, let's go up. Ugh. Come on. Come on, dude. Feedback nope. triggered on 55. I did it. The numbers turn green. Okay, good. 55. Uh, according to the manual, valve B should be tuned to 28 degrees. Valve B to 28. I prefer 98 Got degrees, it. Casey. All you know, some Nick Lachey. Okay, uh, last valve. Too one bad he's second, dead. One second. There we go. Valve C should be set to 67. Oh, that is such a high number. My wrist, Casey. My wrist can't. Valve C set. All numbers green. Awesome. Okay, uh, almost there. Mm -hmm. Now it says depress the automatic okay, power button. mechanism. Power button. Uh, looking at the diagram. I did it. Here, Casey, I did it. Big round button. Yep, Casey, I got it. Obvious. All right. Big round button pressed. Yes! Okay, we're calibrated. Now you need to install this sucker into the pump. Oh. Uh, the pump, it's uh, it's located outside of St. Vincent's Church. Beacon lights will be on to help find it, so that's good. Of course, uh, it'll probably attract walkers, so that sucks. Just be ready. The systems uh. down here will let me know when you've installed the regulator. Oh, and uh, one more thing. A little tip that should make life a bit easier and scavenging more fruitful since, you know, we're colleagues. Oh, now. we are not right? colleagues, Casey, please. Number 47. All right, thank you. I'll see you later. Bye, Casey. 47. Sounds like static, Casey. <sighs> Do I have to let you finish talking before this radio station is going to work? Oh, my God, really? Well, it, it's been a long night, but I'm too wired to sleep. I'm going to turn this place upside down until I find the manual. You should get some rest, though. I'll contact you in the morning. What? Good night, tourist. What? What? No. No, 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 no. No, I'm not going to bed. I don't care if I screwed up your dialogue. We are going to the pump regulator. I'm going to put it in. It's going to be great. Could you point me to the church? That way? Thank you. And of course. The pump regulator is not on. And of course, there's no zombies. I'm guessing I won't be able to put it into the pump regulator here. Let's see. Maybe we just skirted the system, huh? Go. Go, Ed. Go. God damn it, Casey. God damn it. <sighs> All right. All right. I'm going to use my insane time traveling skills to go back and actually listen to you, you piece of garbage. It's Casey. Oh, uh, Casey, I really really want to flood your room Dash zero one. kill okay. me uh, now, kill me turn the dial until you get I did back on says, push the button the I pushed the button Casey I did it uh, looking at the dial, Casey the tower has a radio station number 47 mm -hmm. that broadcasts any significant discoveries in the city and the current schedule for stirring the herd might be wise to tune in before heading out for the day privileged Intel so you know let's uh Let's keep it between us. All right, I'm gonna take a few moments to clear my head. I'll contact you when it's time for the next step. Good luck and Gee. thanks. No, thank you, Casey. That was such a delightful conversation. I'm glad we had it twice. Mm. Hello, Crips. I like it down here. Nobody talks, nobody's loud, nobody's living, just me and my best dead friends. <laughs> Ain't that right? Such good friends. Alright, there better be a light flashing this time. Ah, uh, hello, zombie. Are you here? 
to give me your guts. Mmm, would you look at you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I said thank you. Really do appreciate it, you good boy. I guess we're just going to apply this here real quick. Get ourselves nice and covered in guts. Don't mind me, Mr. Zombie. I'm about to become one of you. Oh, yeah. Hmm, still don't believe my disguise because you saw me, huh? Don't tell your friends. Oh, I ran. Can't run. Oh, arrow. Let's see what we've got over here. Now see, a smart person would just be grateful that they're able to sneak by this horde of beautiful undead. And boy howdy, there are a lot of y'all. Many, many. I'm just going to put this in, okay? Excuse me, excuse me. There we go. That's in. Oh, nice and easy. Now, I do still have some sticky bombs left. Whoa, everybody. Whoa. Okay, everyone's getting a little bit in my face. I literally cannot move. Okay. All right. I'm just gonna... What? Oh, God. <laughs> that did not work. God damn it. Oh, God damn it, Casey. No, this is literally my hell. And away we go again. Hello again. Good to see you. It's like the third time I've killed you. Good talk. Glad we had it. Come here, zombie. Come here. Give me your guts. I need your guts. Thank you so much. Oh, I just like turned your head around. Exorcist style. I'm sorry, dude. Now, my mistake, <laughs> well, it was that I tried to be stealthy. I'm not very good at that. So instead, we're just gonna do this the boom, boom, bang, bang way. And I think that'll work just fine. All right, let's see. One, two, ugh. Well, that did not turn out perfectly. One left. We can do this. We can do this. Okay. Get away. Oh, no. Uh oh. Oh, dang it. Get back. Okay, well... <sighs> yeah, this is working much better. Oh, we still got lots of folk over here, huh? Would you like a hand? <laughs> All right, never mind. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. <sighs> that was so much easier. Thank you. And look at that. Hey, my bomb. Keep you around for next time. Hello, pump regulator. Welcome. There we go. Nice and beautiful and green. I do declare I like it. You're welcome, Casey. You piece of garbage. Hello? Oh, we had a family meeting in here. I'm so sorry to intrude. That was your chest. Oh, this is not going very well. Okay. Settle down. Let me regain a little bit of stam here. Oh. 
I am a slow, tired boy right now. But I also need to scavenge everything. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Don't waste a bullet. I'm wasting a bullet. All right, dirty, dirty old house. What do we got? Oh, oatmeal. Just what the doctor ordered. Tuna? Better than the dog food I usually eat. Breath mint? Love it. Oh, vegetable soup. I'd rather eat the dog food. Recipe for beignet. Beignet. Banana. Banana. You know, all the above. Anything up here? Hello? Man, I would like to play a game of poker. That'd be fun. Oh, this room looks well stocked, if you ask me. Thank you. Thank you, everyone, for being here. On the, am I full? Am I really full? The hell do I got in here? I got a lot of zombie cuts. Don't need all those. Ah, sir, are you here for the family meeting? I'm afraid they are indisposed. Oh, you are one of the diseased walkers. Dang it. Not happy that those have been introduced. All right, Casey. Hey, Casey, you there? Hey, Casey, you there? Yeah, always here. Always thinking. My mind is always swirling. Oh, Casey, Casey, I do it's not care. I installed your thing, okay? Can we talk about that? Yeah, just, just calm it down. To get all worked up. If you want to survive, you need to focus. Steady your mind. Yeah, be yeah, sharp. Well, I guess. But, you know, hey, this morning I realized something. Ugh, what'd you realize? I can't even remember the last time I saw the sky. I don't care. God, it's been a while. At least that much. Yeah, I know. It, look, it, it ain't nice, Once. Casey. It's a pretty shitty I sky. I paid more okay? A lot of clouds. You ever been to the Badlands up in South Dakota? Nope, Casey, I have not. Never, never will. Been. Ah, that's a shame. Like another planet. Yep, I'm sure. My mom used to drive me through there. Oh, the okay. My uncle. The night sky was so bright. Oh, boy. So many stars, like a dome overhead. Yep, I'm Crystal sure, Casey. View of the cosmos. That put a lot of things in perspective for me back I'm then. I'm sure it did. Really needed it. Can we talk about the pump? How insignificant we really are in the grand scheme of things. You are insignificant, troubles, Casey. No matter how you. big they may seem, really don't mean squat. Don't mean shit. I mean, well, what are troubles anyway, huh? The universe doesn't know the meaning of the word. <sighs> I wish I had that badland sky overhead right about now. Yeah, it'd be better than this one, I'll tell you that. You know, first thing I'm gonna do when free is head back north. Cool. I cool, cool, cool. Swamp life. I don't think you're gonna make it, Casey, but that's great. Uh, wow, alright, whatever. Anyway. Let's go back to old 47. Old Town. Crescent City News. Interesting. Wait for Casey to reach out again. Whatever. I think we need to go on a trip. Do some scavenging, get more items. Casey will reach out whenever he's done talking about the Badlands, which may be a few years from now, so we'll head back that way when we want to. Till then, I guess let's just go kill some people. There's a food cache in Old Town. So you know what? Let's go to Old Town.